to the mammoth mission that's now taken place that is Axiom 4's ISS docking at 4.30 p.m. IST. Remember the liftoff took place yesterday itself, the Axiom 4 to dock with the International Space Station. Shooks, the first Indian to be visiting the NASA lab on the ISS. Shooks and team studied pharma tech and blood pressure. First images of Axiom 4 orbiting towards the ISS has now come to surface. Group Captain Shrukla will be becoming the first ever Indian to visit NASA's orbiting laboratory ISS. This is a big day and the docking is to take place at 4.30. We're all keeping a close watch ever since liftoff took place post several delays. And with that, we in fact have Akshita Nandgopal joining us on the broadcast to bring us more details that we're picking up at this point. Akshita, very good morning. Uh, docking is to take place later in the day as we learn, 4.30 p.m. What more are we picking up in terms of details uh, for the day uh, for this very mission? Uh, well, good morning, Shreya, and good morning to all of our viewers. We saw that historic moment of liftoff uh, yesterday. But now is when the actual work begins, which is the next 14 days. Uh, Group Captain Shukla and the rest of the crew will be docked at the International Space Station. And this perhaps is the most instrumental time when the training of Group Captain Shukla also kicks in as the pilot. It's his responsibility to ensure that the docking in the International Space Station is successful. Uh, 4.30 p.m. Indian Standard Time, that's 7 a.m. Eastern Time, uh, is when we're going to be seeing the docking. Uh, it's going to be in all about a two-hour uh, process, which actually kicks off at about 2.30. That's when you'll start getting the first images of uh, the Dragon capsule very, very close to the International Space Station. Uh, we've been tracking the journey of uh, the Dragon through the night. Uh, and this morning, it's now come close to the International Space Station as planned. Uh, and it's been a long 28-hour journey for the entire crew. Imagine just being strapped out to one location, uh, unable to move for 28 hours, no gravity. So you can just imagine how arduous that particular journey is. But uh, for Shrooks, uh, for Peggy Whitson, for Viznowski and Tibor Kapu, they were fully prepared for it because this is what, in fact, they've been training for. So after that 28-hour-long journey, they will finally dock at the ISS. Maneuvering will be done by Group Captain Shukla if there is a need for maneuvering, considering it's fully automated. But in case there is a slight change in trajectory, that's when Group Captain Shukla will immediately ensure that everything moves in the right direction. There's going to be, interestingly, a small welcome party of sorts for the crew at the International Space Station. You've already got crewmates uh, at the ISS uh, currently, so they're waiting to welcome the AX4 crew as well. And in 14 days, full of commitment, loaded with experiments for that we will be reporting on. Absolutely, Akshita. Definitely a big, big day that we in fact witnessed yesterday and in fact only up and about now that we in fact wait for the docking to take place and post that the final uh, party as well that you've spoken about at the ISS. And yes, the crew members there at the ISS currently are waiting to welcome these four on board.